Now here's a feature about Adobe Lightroom that you may not be fully aware of, and that's the ability to import and view video. Now I've been doing this for a number of years now, and I don't use it as my principal viewer, but I have found for some strange reason that when I import video into Lightroom, it actually runs a little bit smoother than many other video dedicated products such as Adobe Premiere Pro. You know, this is the big daddy of uh, Adobe's kind of editing suite. It's very, very good. It has amazing range of features, amazing range of things that you can do to your video clips. But unless you render the video, which normally takes quite a long time, depending on how long the video clip is, it doesn't actually run terribly smoothly. Here we are in Lightroom. I've just imported the clip here. I can click play and off we go. It actually runs amazingly smoothly. It's a pretty amazing place, so it kind of looks pretty good, uh, just played smoothly. Now in Premiere Pro, I'd have to render this and then play it. And of course, if I do anything, if any kind of editing, I'm going to have to re-render it in order to get a smooth playback. So that is a little bit of time consuming, a little bit frustrating. So how do we get video into Adobe Lightroom? Well, the easy answer to that is exactly the same way as you'd import anything. You go to the Import button, click on Import, navigate to where your clips may be stored. Mine are stored in a cunningly named folder called GoPro Clips and hit the import button and away you go. I've got a few other clips in here. So amazingly, uh, and this is due to uh, Adobe probably not participating a great deal, a lot of other people have found workarounds not only to play video but also to edit video in the program as well. So how do you do that? Well, we're not going to get into actually physical editing the clips but I can show you here in the library module uh, we can go to Quick Develop and Quick Develop allows me to apply some of these features, especially under default settings. We have some Lightroom video presets. So clearly the boys at Lightroom have decided that there is a capability to add some effects to video clips. I'm going to choose Color Pop as if you need it. Bang, there it goes. So it applies it to the clip easy peasy and we can just replay. I don't have to go back and re-render it as I would in Premiere Elements or Premiere Pro. And of course, if I don't like that, I hit the Reset All button and we're back to the original clip. So very easy. There's a whole bunch of settings under Lightroom video presets. Well, there are a few anyway. Uh, and I'll show you in another video how to actually apply your own homemade preset to your video clips in order to change the color or change the tonality.